We're now going to go through running a program in the Pacer software for the Force 3 treadmill. Simply go to Program Designer, click on Load, open the program you want to run, in this case a single sprint, and then click on Dashboard. To give the athlete information we have counting stage, visual cues and sound cues checked. Once you're ready to start the program, simply click on Run Program. And this begins the program with cues for the athlete. The idea is for the athlete to keep their green line as close as possible to their target range, which is the red line. Jog. You can see the real-time feedback at the top of the graph Sprint. showing distance, time, speed, force, work, power and if the athlete was wearing a heart rate monitor it would show heart rate as well. Program finished. Once the test is completed, we can go to report. It'll give us a report for the period of the test. You see here it's from 0 seconds to 60.2 seconds. Total distance 94.6. It gives you a average velocity, peak velocity, a time of peak velocity, average power, peak power, time of peak power, horizontal force, peak force, time of peak force, vertical force, Average, peak, time of peak, vertical force. It also gives us uh, split times. For every 10 metres, because that's uh, what we have set in the options tab. I can then go to our graphs. We can plot distance. Velocity. We can clear the velocity to the target velocity go to power horizontal force vertical force we can also zoom in on a portion of the graph In this class we'll focus on the sprint portion just by left clicking and dragging And you can see you got your start point and end point and the period that is selected. Got all your values, time, velocity. Click on report and go back to the report page. And it will now focus on just that portion of the graph that's selected. Here you can see we've got the periods from 39.07 seconds to 53.47 seconds. Total distance of 40 metres in that period and your velocities, power, horizontal force and vertical force for that period. If we go back to graphs, we can zoom back out by left clicking and dragging in the opposite direction. We can also zoom in on our vertical forces for the portion of the graph. completed viewing all the data you can save the trial just by clicking on save trial give it a suitable name and click on save